What's up guys, it's Grant here, dropping another tier list video. I'm gonna be looking at the Armory Update skins, the three collections, the Case, and the Limited Time Desert Eagle. Uh, really excited to be looking at these skins. They're all really cool. I'm really excited that Valve actually dropped an update and looks like they're updating. Might be a bit of copium, but it is what it is. Uh, I'm a little tired. I've been moving, as you can probably tell from the lack of stuff in the background of the video and the setup. Um, but yeah, let's just jump right into it. Let's look at these skins. Starting this list off, we're going to be looking at the Heat Treated Desert Eagle. Um, honestly, it's just a dollar store version of the Case Harden, but you know, obviously the, the Desert Eagle didn't have a Case Harden finish. Um, I think that this looks good, and I've seen a lot of the, like, the Blue Gem versions of it, and it looks fantastic, but there's a lot of room for it to not look fantastic. And so for that, I'm going to honestly rate this in C tier. First, we're going to be looking at the second case of CS2, the gallery case, and the 027 USPS, it, it's a blue. It's it's a blue. Um, the silencer is cool. It's different. It's not, you know, your basic copy and paste, you know, uh, suppressor. Um, but other than that, there's not much really to write home about. I will be putting that in D. Next, we have the Calligraphy Deagle. Uh, and honestly, it's not too bad. Like, it kind of gives wasteland rebel vibes uh but or we're kind of like a rat rod type energy um all in all it's not terrible it's just kind of a blue, another blue deagle um throw that in steve next we have the statics mp5 uh first off it's mp5 um it's an easy d tier um but the skin itself is clean it's basic but not bad very very just kind of there um d tier next we have the aug lux trim and I, I like this actually like for a blue skin this is really nice it's shiny uh the gold silver uh like the gunmetal uh, gray you know it, it it's nice it it's honestly really clean um throw that in c tier the Hypnosis M249, um, it's a, it's a blue. Uh, the artwork is okay. Um, not much, again, not much to write home about. It's it's just a kind of a regular blue. Let's throw that in D tier. The Tango R8 is actually really nice. I love this rose artwork as well as like the gold accents of the just overall skin, and not to mention the wood engraving on this thing. Honestly not gonna lie this is one of the cleaner skins in this case honestly and unfortunately it's on the r8 but that being said it's clean we're gonna throw that in b tier the trailblazer scar uh honestly gives me black nile vibes it looks like a black nile scar uh, auto sniper uh with you know obviously some white flames here uh honestly it's not terrible um genuinely throw this in top of d the turbine m4 is okay it's not crazy it's not bad by any means it's a decent okay skin um but it's kind of just there to me personally for a purple it's just kind of eh throw that in low c the hydro strike dualies are actually super cool like i don't know if you guys have seen these in game at all but they are some of the coolest skins to drop in cs2 um it not only are they cool blue skins and they look like water guns uh they actually have water driplets on the side uh it's very cool and very clean uh, we're gonna be throwing that in a tier the saiba oni mac 10 is another clean skin uh just another beautiful skin well made just very pretty the red pink just it's wonderful i like the artwork on it like that's just another easy A tier. The Randy Rush P90 is very mid for a purple skin. Uh, it definitely could be worse, but it's just kind of eh. It's not anything to really write home about. Um, D tier. The Rapid Transit Scout is... This is beautiful. This rivals the Prince Stream. It's just... It's it's a clean white skin, black accents with obviously the rainbow colors mixed in here. This is just nice. This is a wonderful skin. This is actually a solid S tier skin. The Outsiders AK, it looks like if you wore glasses and you dropped your glasses 
and you looked at the fire serpent. Um, it genuine. The first thing I thought when I saw this was this is like a dollar store fire serpent. Um, that being said, though, it's not bad. I don't. When I say dollar store dollar, fire serpent, it doesn't mean it's bad. It just means it gives the same colors. It's the same energy vibe uh, for this skin. Um, that being said, honestly, throw this in C tier right above the eagle. The Epicenter P250 is actually really cool. Uh, I already like the P250 as as just a gun itself, and I think that this is really cool. Uh, I haven't really looked at the pattern, but if the like center moves around on the skin, that makes it an easy A tier. Uh, otherwise, it's just a nice soft B. Another beautiful neo noir skin. Uh, you can't hate on this collection. Like the collection of neo noir skins all look really good and it is no exception for the ump um not much to say other than this is a solid b tier the gold tooth glock is fun it's just a fun skin if you've looked at it in game the pink is shiny the gold tooth is shiny it's it's genuinely just a good good skin and just very creative a tier vaporwave m4a1 is stunning it is beautiful um it's one of those skins that you shouldn't put stickers on because of how just beautiful the artwork is you know um not much to say other than it's s tier now we're going to be looking at the sports and field collection starting off with the mp5 savannah halftone um yeah no it's it's kind of just ugly like, there's no real other way to say it. It's kind of just ugly. D tier. Tiger Stencil Tech 9. Um, very just kind of bland. I mean, it's, I mean, yeah, bland. Half Sleeve Moss. Uh, it's, it's blue. It's a, I mean, it's an okay blue skin. The gold accents, not bad. Um, but same fate as the other ones. D. Oh, now for a you know light blue skin, this is solid. It gives it gives like Safari mesh and Predator vibes, but a little bit more vibrant. A little bit higher in D tier. The PP buys in Cold Cell honestly looks kind of cool. Um, I like the blue. I like the silver. It's pretty solid uh, all in all for a light blue skin. Um, but it's still honestly not enough to get out of D tier. The Mag Seven Wildwood is honestly kind of cool for artwork. You get the you have the green skin, but then you get like the, the brown like you know twigs in it. But then you have the you know copper accents that actually work off it really well. Um, I could actually throw that in C tier. The Xeno Scout, uh, solid you know honestly great black to white silver skin black scope you know red accents kind of clean um honestly can imagine this being a really good like budget skin i think personally but all in all this is kind of cool um i'll throw that in c tier as well p250 small game um it's 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 very average it's 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 you know it is what it is uh the i, I would imagine this looking really good with like uh, like big game gloves um but other than that or like the uh, can't remember which specials gloves, but this would look really good with those. Um, all in all, D tier. The Yorkshire Nova is actually really cool. Um, it's actually very shiny in game. Uh, the gold and red is very clean, actually. Um, solid C tier. The Alpine Camo honestly gives me like discount purple DD pet. It's very cool, and it honestly has like some like f like iridescent slash like case hardened like bits in it it's actually a really pretty skin like a really pretty usps skin throw that in high c now i'm questioning why they gave the heat treated to the 57 since it already had a case hardened counterpart um but just like the deagle it's it's got its highs with its blues and it's got its lows with its d's i'm a big case hardened fan and i think that the where like the case hardens have the gold gems that look really good, just like, you know, some blue gems. Um, 
this they when this looks bad it looks bad it's not as good as the deal too so d tier the arctic tritone is actually kind of like simple but clean simple but effective you know the the clean white with like a little bit of blue mixed in with some yellow it's very clean it, it's like you know denver nuggets you know basketball like it's what it gives um oh, c tier the crimson foil is actually really cool um it starts off red but when you in game it swaps like it it changes from red to like a goldish orange it's actually very nice it's very cool very awesome like very nice uh a tier the rainbow spoon galil is actually very cool it's basically the prism skins from valorant um but you know it's now on cs uh on a galil it's cool it's shiny it's bright vibrant um i don't think it's as good as the ump but it's definitely very nice beats here the axia glock is actually really nice they brought the glitter pattern or the grill the axia glock is actually really cool they actually brought the uh, that glitter finish from the stickers onto an actual skin and it looks really good in game um solid beats here and then the m4 fade is just again instant s tier this is just a beautiful beautiful skin the fade collection of skins is already nice um i don't think it's as good as the glock it's definitely better than the op and it's definitely better than the mp7 and the mag 10 and so for that easy s tier with the graphics collection we're looking at the spectrogram uh m249 and it's act i mean if you wanted a purple loadout this would be the perfect uh m249 skin if you run an m249 um but on that note d tier the halftone whirl scout is just like the m249 it's just kind of eh it's very eh d tier the halftone wash go uh the halftone wash famas is actually kind of clean um unironically you know this white you know going in with like the blue mixed in you know the the dark gray like honeycomb grid look it, it's genuinely kind of nice um for that i throw this in high d tier the astro lab mp7 is honestly just use the default at this point it's kind of just very eh very meh very bland if I had an E tier, E tier, but low D tier. The NV Galil is actually kind of nice, like genuinely, like this dark gray and this just like the hints of lime green, that bright green is actually kind of clean, uh, C tier. The Coral Halftone P2K is kind of just another light blue. It's just very bleh, very bland. Um, I don't think it's as bad as some of the skins that are in this light blue category, but it's definitely still there d tier the wildberry scar is actually very vibrant it's actually really kind of you know pretty um if you run a scar and you have a blue or a purple loadout this could actually work really well and fit in it um but d tier the sg berry gel coat is interesting i like the red like legitimately i like the red um but i really don't care for the rest of it d tier the cross fade ak it looks like they just kind of threw shit together all honesty like i want to like it but i just can't bring myself to like it d tier same thing with the halftone shift xm it's kind of just there like they kind of just threw shit together you know like it's very just bland like it it looks like it wants to be a fade so bad how it goes from like light green to like this the fucking military tone green to like the gray and then the gray goes to the blue it it just looks like a, a vomit fade if it wasn't e tier i would throw it there but d tier now we're getting into the good skins of this graphics collection because this cz is actually really clean like it's not even because it's a pink it's just like the white with like these color like these bright vibrant colors and like the hints of gray like this looks good like this is just, this is a good skin 
B tier. The attack vector P90 also kind of looks like it was thrown together, but it was done right. Like they're all vibrant colors. Like they all look good. Like the the whites to into the pink, the pink into like the, the purples and the blues. It's genuinely a solid skin. Uh, C tier. The Polysoup M4 is honestly a good like pink pearlescent pink skin. It's it's nice. Like it's it's pretty. Um, it's not much else to really say about it. It's a nice pink skin, uh, C tier. Now, the Starcade is nice. It's got that glitter tone that the Glock had earlier from the other collection. But this one's, like, amplified. It's all over instead of just on the handle. Like, this is bright. It's vibrant. It sticks out. Like, this pops. Um, it's a little bit too much, too much for me. Like, it's just, it's just way too much. But that being said, it's solid skin, and I'll throw that in A tier. The Little Pig Aug is kind of just, for a pink, is kind of just meh. It's very underwhelming. Like, the character, the pig is cute, but the rest of the skin is just very meh and underwhelming. D tier. Same thing with his op. Like, the CMYK op, it, it looks like it had potential to be something but it's just like they threw stuff together and said hey here's a here's an op skin enjoy um d tier the mean the midnight paint over five seven is you know it's another light blue but it's got some you know writing on it um d tier the wash me p90 is you know okay it's just kind of you know it looks like a dirty window with writing you know smudged in um for creativity i will give this a high d the neon squeezer mp5 um d tier the wash me please m4 a1 is kind of like the p90 earlier it's just kind of it's there it's like I, this shines in game it's it's okay uh d tier the tilted deagle is actually really clean i like this blue i like this yellow this is kind of actually a really nice skin um c tier the, the negev wall bang it's just graffiti uh you know like like the graffiti spot in overpass d tier the metallic squeezer you know another graffiti like s skin but the silver on the black looks really cool the yellow handles actually were kind of actually neat um c tier the pip squeak mac 10 is adorable um the the first off the black to blue is just clean that's just a very clean transition very clean just skin in general but the freaking goddamn mouse hamster adorable b tier the the worst hole fantastic um it's such a meme skin it, it it's like if the blazed eagle was made now like you know in this this time in 2024 um or by the broadcasters skibbity hot dog um c tier teal graph glock very underwhelming very meh very bland d the sweet little angels dualies um bright vibrant vibrant the Sweet Little Angels Dooley's bright, vibrant, you know, the pastel colors, you know, it's kind of pretty, actually. Um, the babies are kind of creepy, but all in all, C tier. The Monster Melt XM. Um, bright, all of the Overpass characters for the Overpass collection. C. The Eye of Zappum's og is okay it's not anything great it's very busy very just a lot d tier the krakow op um this is fun this is bright i like this um the characters the robot the heart all of the pink a tier the dragon snore zeus Listen, it's the second Zeus skin, um, and it's the doodle, the doodle lore, you know, dragon, um, S tier. And then finally, the B, the monster, AK, um, yeah, I mean, it's the monster, the monster head, 
the characters holding it you know they're they're cool they're solid um but i don't think it's the best red on this list so b thank you guys so much for watching me mumble and try not to fall asleep while doing this tier list um i really appreciate it make sure you guys comment down below what skins you've gotten from each collection if you've gotten any so far um like subscribe and i'll see you next time bye